under clear skies, stretching far into the horizon, lies the lush woodland of the Greater Bay Area. Deep in the mountains, gurgling streams nourish blossoming Paphiopetalum purpuratum. Orchid plants form one of the biggest families of flowering plants on Earth. Apart from the sheer number, orchids display marvelous diversity in vegetative and reproductive structure. Back in 1936, British plant hunters identified Paphiopedilum purpuratum in Hong Kong for the first time. Hence its moniker, Miss Hong Kong. The species is mostly found in remote, cramped spaces. Its favorite companions are decomposing fallen leaves and thriving moss on riverside boulders. Towards the late autumn, the orchid begins to blossom. As its habitat isn't accessible to butterflies, this resourceful plant makes clever use of its unique flower to lure those greedy insects. Although lacking pollen or nectar to feed the pollinators, the plant's bright flowers send off luring smells that contain some 50 chemicals. Many of which mimic various female insects. The crescent-like stamen or pistil inside the flower takes the shape of a female hoverfly. And the folds at the pocket are coated with tiny spots resembling aphids. Endowed with such effective instruments, all it does is wait patiently. The male hoverfly leaps at its presumed love interests, while the aphid-like spots convince the female of the abundance of food for laying their eggs. When they wake up to the ruse and stomp off angrily, they leave carrying the sticky pollens of Paphiopedilum purpuratum. The insects tend to have very short memories. When they clap eyes on another beauty or aphid pantry, they will swoop in again without hesitation. The repeated journeys thereby promote the orchid's reproduction. Through this extraordinary survival strategy, Paphiopedilum purpuratum has secured a place in the exuberant woodland. <laughs>